Hello, this video will introduce how to use the pulse oximeter or pulse ox reader. If you received a pulse ox from Oxygen Now, it comes in a blue protective sleeve and a connecting lanyard. The purpose of a pulse ox is to read the patient's oxygen level and pulse. Start by taking out the pulse ox and pressing the small white button on the front of the machine. It is recommended that you use the index finger or the middle finger. Do not use the thumb. Begin by placing the finger into the pulse ox face down. Make sure that you put your finger all the way in and press snugly around your finger. Usually will notice a change in numbers, but the true reading takes a moment. To get an accurate reading, the best posture for blood flow is to have a relaxed sitting or laying position with your hand at the same level as the heart. How to read the numbers. The larger number is your pulse oxygen saturation or oxygen level ranking from 100%. Below 70% indicates extremely low oxygen and the numbers will not be very accurate. The smaller number is your pulse rate. Be aware of your average resting heart rate and what it should be at. There should also be a pulse intensity bar graph display along the side. When reading the levels on the pulse ox, typically 95% oxygen level is considered normal for most individuals. A level of 92% indicates hypoxemia or deficiency of oxygen reaching tissues in the body. If the pulse ox indicates 90% or lower, seek medical attention. At this point, the patient will be experiencing symptoms such as headache, dizziness, fatigue, shortness of breath, nausea, or diarrhea. 30 minutes to an hour of medical grade oxygen should raise your oxygen levels quickly and dissipate those symptoms. Machine use or troubleshooting. This machine is sensitive. When trying to read the oxygen levels, too much movement will mess up this machine. Try to be still when taking the oxygen readings. Do not move your arm. Have it relaxed parallel near the heart. It cannot read accurately with artificial nails or dark nail polish. Cold hands will not pick up a good reading. Patients should rub hands together or run them under hot water for a few minutes before taking the reading. Low battery. There is a percentage indication on the home screen, but if you are having troubles anyway, always be sure to check the battery on the back side, just to be sure. And you can replace the batteries right here and take another reading by pressing the small white button and starting over. Again, thank you for using Oxygen Now, and you can always call us at this number here below for any more questions.